Hey everyone! I've got some exciting news, especially for all my fellow comedy and quiz show lovers out there. Set your calendars because this Sunday, October 6, something super cool is premiering on Max, and you don't want to miss it. You know I love a good laugh and this one's going to deliver. Alright so check it out, it's called Have I Got News For You. If you've heard of it before you're probably familiar with the British version, which has been a long-running hit across the pond. Well, they've brought it stateside with a fresh new twist and it's going to be amazing. The show is basically a comedy current events quiz where two teams battle it out, answering questions about the week's news stories. But here's the kicker, the points don't really matter. Yeah, you heard that right. It's all about the laughs, the witty banter, and those hilarious moments that make you forget about the real score. Now let's talk about the awesome cast. Hosting this hilarious ride is none other than Roy Wood Jr. You might know him from The Daily Show or his stand-up comedy, and let me tell you his sharp sense of humor and timing make him the perfect fit for this role. He's going to be moderating the madness and throwing out the quiz questions. And if you've seen him in action before, you know he's going to nail it. Then we've got two incredible team captains who are regulars on the show, Amber Ruffin and Michael Ian Black. Yes, that's right. Amber Ruffin, who you probably know from The Amber Ruffin Show and her killer writing for Late Night with Seth Meyers, is bringing her charm and quick wit. And Michael Ian Black, who's been cracking us up for years in everything from the state to wet hot American summer, is the other team captain. Trust me, with these two the banter is going to be next level. Each week, they'll bring on a rotating lineup of celebrity guests to join the teams, and who knows what kind of hilarity will unfold. The chemistry between the captains, guests, and Roy Wood Jr. is sure to keep us all entertained from start to finish. And guys, one of the things I love about shows like this is that you don't have to be a news junkie to enjoy it. Yes, they'll be talking about current events, but it's done in such a funny and light-hearted way that you'll be laughing along even if you haven't kept up with the latest headlines. It's the kind of show you can watch with friends, have a good time, and maybe even get a little up-to-date on what's going on in the world, without all the seriousness. So do yourself a favor, mark your calendar for this Sunday, October 6th, and make sure to check out Have I Got News For You on Max. Whether you're into comedy, current events, or just need something light to kick back and enjoy, this show is going to be your new go-to. It's got the perfect mix of humor, smart commentary, and celebrity guests that'll keep you coming back week after week. I don't know about you, but I am so ready for a good laugh, and this show seems like exactly what we need right now. Plus, who doesn't love a quiz show where the points don't really matter, right? It's all about the fun and this is going to be a blast. Let me know in the comments if you're planning to watch, and if you've seen the British version before, I'd love to hear your thoughts on what we can expect from the American take on it. I'll definitely be tuning in this Sunday and probably live tweeting my reactions because this looks too good not to share in real time. Thanks for hanging out and I'll see you in the next video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on all the fun content we've got coming your way. Peace. Victory Hand.